good, YouTube? You know, it's your boy, TSJ Starbucks. All that good shit. I probably won't come up with a, a secondary name since I ain't there having sneakers anymore. But you, I don't just show you a glimpse. As you see, my uh, stock is kind of going down. This is like that row, second row, down. Excuse my dirty clothes. And right here is all sneakers for sale. But let's get to the reason why I'm making this video. This is basically a quick pickup video. I got three more jerseys that just came in. Uh, I got at least maybe six or seven more on the way. But these are the first three that came in. I wanted to do a big unboxing video or unbagging, whatever you want to call it, video. But I had a day off, so I said, let me just do these three first. Do the rest of them when they come, probably over the weekend. And... After I do all that, I probably won't be copying jerseys, like, a lot more jerseys for, like, another month or so. So, I'm just going to review all the ones I got. But, let's get into the unboxing. Now, y'all got to bear with me because I'm doing this with one hand. It looks like someone already tried to go in my package already. And these came actually quicker. Today is Tuesday. I thought they wouldn't be here till. Uh, like Thursday. Full transit. Oh, he double bagged it. I like that. Good shipping. I'm not going to show you what well, address is not that. You don't need to see it. So this one looks like my Dan Marino jersey. And it is this one is made by I have no idea who this is made by I see a little minor cracking nothing too serious nothing I'll die over not super huge football but this is very very vintage it's I believe a large look at the tag yes yeah, is made by logo uh, they don't even have the size tag on here, I don't think. Check the inside. Uh, I don't see no size tag, but it's cool for what I paid. I paid only like $20 for it. Nothing serious. You see the, uh, everything is starting to fade out a little bit. But y'all got to understand something. These jerseys are very vintage. Don't get me wrong. I get a little upset sometimes I see things like that. But when you, you get what you pay for. So... These jerseys was made in the early 90s. These, this is not a reproduction. This is vintage, basically. But let's get on to the next one. I don't know what's what. It's one jersey. I know that's probably in here. And I wanted to look at it. But if I, if it's this one, I'll just show it last. And i just open the next package. What is this? Yeah, this is, i show that one last. I don't know who this one is. I think this is from one of my favorite teams. I believe it's a football jersey. And that being said, I should know who jersey it is. If you watched my last video, you know who my favorite team is. This is very good for doing with him. I got your camera, man. But this is, oh, is this a letter? Oh, it's a little invoice. This is anything for the purchase. This is a champion replica Carolina Panthers jersey. And no, this is a size 48, which is actually large. And no, this is not from like published out recently. This is very old. Who's the player? Collins. I don't know who that is. I told you I don't know players like that. But I was being impatient buying a white one, so I said I might as well get one of these vintage ones. Now, on to the last jersey I wanted to get. I got this on a whim because all the jerseys I found of this team, it's a basketball jersey, all the jerseys I found of this team was very expensive. And, I, like, teams I'm not really into, but I like their jerseys. I could care less about the player as long as I get the jersey. So this one is Dallas Mavericks. I believe it's Jim Johnson. Let me see the back. Yep, Jim Johnson. Yeah, but those are my three jerseys. I guess I'll get back to y'all later on Saturday, which today is Tuesday, another four days. 
and unpackage the rest of them. One.